would be very difficult, I think, to, to kind of keep that stuff. And you bring up the point of uh, organized religion. You know, I've gone through that. I've gone through that stuff to, as well. We haven't talked about it on the show, but I've, I've gone through that, some of that stuff. And I really don't think most of the religions in the world, I don't think would have a problem with it. Like if they found it. God's an alien. We've talked about it before. Uh, like I, I, I've, you know, I've read some literature for some, like, you know, some mm. certain sects of like, you know, priests, some Catholic priests would be like, it's fine. Like it, it, religion, religion has survived finding what out that the earth is not flat. Listen, it doesn't guys, revolve around, guys. you know, the sun doesn't revolve around the earth. Like, listen, don't focus, don't things. focus on all the terrible things we've done. Focus on this. Mm. All right. Don't worry say, about that. They, all right. We're not diddling. This the is. Ca- yeah, the Catholic <laughs> church rolled with all their pre, they were moving around their priests to diddle kids. I'm sure they'd figure out a way to fucking roll with their alien <laughs> wow. life out there. I'm sure well, they okay. could figure that out real quick. Yeah. Uh, well, yeah. Not to mention that. And then get into that stuff. But yeah, but I'm saying like the core topic. tenets of like Christianity <laughs> would not be affected at all by, by That's that. That's really I don't good point. Really. Um, I think it would be, I think just like anything in humanity, it would be a great divide in the Christian faith. I think, mm-hmm. I think oh, they'd be, find so, some way to just be some it. people would be like, oh, this, we That's found the God. This was God, actually. This is now we're going to spin yeah. it this way. And there's some people who'd be like, you're a liar. There's no way that's God because he hasn't come back yet. Dude, I, I, but I'm yeah. like, that's already a thing. I'm like, dude, there's people in Appalachia that like snakes are the shit. And like, I like those people. Like, get, They're getting fun. bit by snakes is the doorway to heaven. Like, okay, like, right. I'm, okay. Right. Between, between, <laughs> Between Dan and me, physically, if one of us were to drive to the other city, we'd be going through, you know, snake Love country, country. Yeah. Uh, yeah. The, the Pentecostals. But, but so I'm saying the organized religion thing is like it's less about an organized uh, a, a religion, right? A revealed religion, the kind with a book and everything. It, it's less like uh, it's less a matter of them going, oh, crap whoops maybe we're wrong and it's much more like it creates a new theater of philosophical war between these existing religions right because every one worth its salt will like you guys said will incorporate it into its existing Mm -hmm. belief system right and then yeah. it'll be another Absolutely. one of those examples. Yeah, because it's yeah. going to make us, we're going to have to write a new book, and you're going to have to donate even more money, obviously, <laughs> right. right? Like, that's just the way it is. Yeah. <laughs> we need a second pope. We need a space pope on the yeah. Space pope, yep. Yeah. What do you space think God was doing pope. between days one and seven? in the pot for space right? pope. Yeah. He's doing this, all this other shit, right? <laughs> right. This is yeah, just our book. But, right? um, There's other books. <laughs> yeah, go, but going back to the, the point about the keeping the scientists quiet about it i think it would be very yeah, difficult because you would kill them you but you would need because the, but the thing is is like you, kill them. you can't just kill them because you need to they study this thing you don't just like seal well, it yeah. up like even then you the bring people, in new ones <laughs> kill those ones bring in new ones uh, okay. Okay. Well, they discover you kill them <laughs> an, an interesting interesting thing that uh andrew and i when we went to this a little, little tangent but it'll, it'll get to the point here. When we went mm. to WrestleMania, we stayed with a guy <laughs> <laughs> who discovered an alien civilization no, 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 no. in his backyard in Florida. I'm like Orlando, Florida. No, 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 no. Hey, All right, okay. Hey, 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 introduce him. Hey, hey, it's coming full circle. Give him a check in. Around. It's right. coming around. Full circle. All right. So All first right. off, Chris Jericho and Kevin Owens. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Uh, we stayed with a guy who, when we went to WrestleMania, and he was telling us a story that he knew a guy who owned this hotel off Cape Canaveral, okay. right? And uh, he actually owned the hotel that the astronauts got debriefed in. And they would land, so they would come back to Earth, they'd get collected, and they would stay at this hotel for like four weeks, and they were not allowed to leave. Oh, and yeah. like, And so it's like, you know, you... You're not allowed to leave. You, you put these guys in, and you're like, if you imagine, like, you just sat there and you're like, you're not going to say anything. You're like, well, how can I not say anything? You're like, and you're just constantly threatened and bombarded and told what you're going to be, you, you, what what narrative you're going to put out, right? Like, I, right. I, you could easily be swayed, right? Well, in, in, 
some amount of time. If that doesn't work, just give him a lobotomy. Oh, like yeah, yeah, yeah. Make, uh, give him uh, the old Manchurian <laughs> candidate treatment. Uh, um, that's So what's interesting there is that uh, this is something a lot of folks in the U.S. are not aware of, but there is a way to control control us nerds. It's called the National Invention Secrecy Act, uh, it, which, which is, okay, I like so it. back in 1951. Like yeah, and then back, this is a true story. And this is for uh, any time I hear people talking about technological suppression as being a little too woo-woo, a little too out there. Since 1951, in the United States, Uncle Sam has had the ability to uh, not to see every invention, proposed invention, right? Anytime something touches the patent system or an interesting paper gets published uh, and go to the, the patent applicant and say, one, good hustle, bud. Two, it's ours now. Three, you cannot tell anyone for the rest of your life. If people ask you about it, you don't know what they're talking about, right? And we'll give you what we feel like is a fair price for your invention. Um, that is a very real thing. And it is so, I, I mean, it's, you can you can Google or use your search browser of choice for Invention Secrecy Act of 1951, and what you'll find is even today the public is guessing at how many different um, breakthroughs have been pulled into this. So if you if you're able to bring out the boogeyman of national security, right, a place on the global stage in in almost any uh, any country on this planet, then you'll see attempts like these these laws. So I can only imagine the same thing would apply in space law. I'm being very lazy with <laughs> like sci-fi now. Yeah. Like just put space in front of shit. Space law. Well, they do have space. Something. They do have space law and ISS. And like the ISS does force? have. They do, well, the ISS does. Like the ISS and above there, there is an agree. They do have an agreement. There is like an the on bubble the of the ISS. Agreement that there the is the hasn't line. there been a space crime committed? I'm pretty there sure. Has. They drilled that fucking hole in the. Yeah, yeah, no, oh, no. And somebody was somebody was emailing Sexually something. Assaulted. Or something. Yeah, there's yeah. Some, there's some kind of yeah. email thing going on. That's why we have Space Force. That's why we have Space Force. That's why. This episode is brought to you by Space Force. Space, space Force. Force. Yeah. Solving crime in a spacey time. <laughs> 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 Got to do it, man. I I'd, I'd have to say that like the National Inventions thing is like, but is that uh, just to ask you like from your knowledge like do you, is that does it extend like solely to like you said, breakthroughs. It would be stuff like practical applied knowledge. Like it would have to be something that they're actually putting together or something like that. Because I feel like if you were going to be like, I need like, there's some weird writing here. I need to reach out to a couple different linguistics departments because I have no idea what I'm looking at and I need some people to kind of like bounce ideas off. Right. Of, you right? have to crowdsource, right? You know, because I mean, it's, it's any type of like scientific research, it's all collaborative, like that kind of stuff. It's like you can't just bring one person and be like, it, it's not like the old school, what was the one, the one Russian scientist who decrypted the entire like Aztec uh, pictograph language, like by oh, himself, yeah, yeah, him yeah, and his yeah. cat, like him and his fucking cat. And, yeah. um, I, but it's not like that anymore. Now it's like, yeah, they we can, nailed it. Now we can do it. Uh, now we, now it's very, because it, it, it's easier to be able to, you know, we live in the age of information and being able to Ooh. reach out to, to other sources and it's reach much out um, into space. Yeah. yeah, reach out through nice. space. Nice. <laughs> you get space mail. Um, yes, you know. space mail to the new email. It's something like that. So I'm wondering if that would that would extend like the national adventures. Like it's not it's not like it. It's not like a plasma cannon, like you know. No, or a death you're right. Ray, you're you know? you're right, and that's um, a very good point. I mean, so for that, um, main, mainly, I think in, in the case of the uh, Invention Secrecy Act, a lot of what they're scooping up or hoovering up now is probably. SIGINT uh, crypto techniques uh, that were that for the vast majority right. of the public stealth technology be, stuff like oh, I would right. I would it's think stuff gonna, like that like you know yeah, yeah. those things you, you're gonna you're gonna read it and you're gonna be like well. I'm proud of these guys, but it's paint. What's the big deal? But the uh, but with your your question there, I don't know. I mean, the more we talk about it, we're already building this bridge of what ifs, right? The more we talk about it, the more mm -hmm. we have to we have to conclude <laughs> that it would eventually leak. 
right? Someone would, yeah. someone somewhere in the chain would feel it is their responsibility as a human, right, to pull a Snowden or a Manning or an Assange. Consequences be damned. And for some it's out, reason, they just out. randomly get suicided after, and it's right, like, yeah, it yeah. They they accidentally shoot themselves twice in the back of the head while they stuff themselves into a bag, in a duffel bag, yeah. 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 Yeah, it would be pretty standard. Yeah. It, it would just be a strange thing standard to find. Shade. Um cuz I mean, I just, yeah. Hey guys, thanks for watching. I know it's annoying to watch these broken up in 10-minute segments, but here's the next one over here, or if you want to watch the whole thing uncut and after hours, just click this link to our website and uh, give us a donation, you get full access to it on Patreon. Anyways, thanks guys, enjoy the next video.